Alright, welcome back to Millennium Dawn A to Z. It's, it's been a little while, hasn't it? Like two weeks? Yeah, I, I, I promise not to let that happen again. Anyway, we're playing as Belarus. We probably have decent industry uh, to civs. Never mind, our industry kind of sucks ass. Wow, look at those planes we get. So many planes, we don't have manpower for them, so all of that clicking was pointless. I don't really know what to do about this debt pile. I mean, somehow the debt itself is quite low. That ain't gonna last. So another thing I should say is that I am finally home from that wicked place called a school. I'm back home. I've got all winter break to do fuck knows what. And I decided what that fuck knows what is. I've got a YouTube channel. Why not just start uploading more than once a week? Maybe twice or three times over the weekend. More me wanting to die. Who doesn't want that? Well, I mean, other than me, who doesn't want that? That's what I'm asking. I know I don't want it, but who cares what I think? Wanna know a fun fact? I was making more money as my Barbados. My Space Force Barbados made more money than this Belarus does. How did my tiny little island nation of fucking Barbados over here in the Caribbean... How did this tiny little thing... I mean, I, I get the AI's kind of using its cheats, but like, even Barbados is almost making as much money as my Belarus. What is this place? I can't tell if it's dollar store porn or Russia's literal defecation. Oh, come on. Why is Russia going democratic? I mean, I, I, I want to kill someone. Maybe like Lithuania here. They only have six to 8,000 men. Latvia is one of the 2,000 men. I mean, I could kill the whole Baltic maybe if I want to. They go for... I mean, maybe I could naval invade somewhere in Scandinavia. These guys are probably weak as... This mouse button really is not- Of course, mouse. This middle button on my mouse, I- I fucking hate it. Dude! It is really acting up today. Like, I am having to mash this thing into the ground. That, does that fix it? Okay, maybe. Maybe smashing my mouse like some rage monster helps. Look, this number is currently the amount of girls I've had sex with. <laughs> I bet this is the face all of my audience makes when I make shitty jokes like that. <laughs> you know what? I think I think we're just gonna up our military spending. It's not gonna cost us anymore because we don't have military factories. Honestly, I don't think I'm even gonna bother with military factories. I'm probably gonna do. I'm probably just gonna keep the same strategy I did last game and just invest in infrastructure, construction, and all that. There's really no point in researching like weapons if you're still on World War II weapon systems. It's not really worth it. Yes, finally some manpower. There we go. Now I can field all these planes. This is like Belarus's only only good perk. They they have 445. That is very impressive. Well, it, it, that also Jesus Christ. The yellow bar just went up to to the heavens. I didn't think all of that yellow bar was manpower, but I guess it was. Belarus, you are fucked up. Wow, that really did make a difference. We went from 10,000 to 32,000 men. Can ask for a debt bailout from our neighbor Ukraine. Let's see if Ukraine accept- You actually accepted that. No offense, but you're kind of an idiot. Because not only did you hardly help to pay it off, you're in a hole yourself. All right, we're in the ideology that gives the good old days. The good old days. As Belarus, we don't have good old days. This country's existed for 10 years, if. Unless you're talking about before Belarus's existence, okay. The, 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 the fucking peasants in Tsarist Russia? Are those the good old days? You want me to put half my population back on the farm fields without property? Without their own home? Without food or water? The good old days. That's what, that's what the, uh, the wise boomers tell you. Wait, Belarus has elections? In what world does Belarus have an election? Uh, something that tells me it's kind of like Russia's elections, because I'm pretty sure this, this kid is still in power today. I recognize that mustache. Either he's really popular, or something funky's going on behind the scenes. Yeah, there we go. 12 billion. You saved me for a whopping 30 seconds. Yes! That was the most awkward hiccup. I have ever had. Bro, low, like, how do I only hiccup once? How does that work? You'd expect me going like, uh, uh, uh. But I'm not. I'm just, I'm not, I'm not sure how to explain that. So I'm just going to blame it on my mental, my mental sanity going down the drain. I hope it's good enough excuse for you. I'm not going to lie. That is a very geared up tank though. Like, Jesus Christ. Look at all these basic bitches. 
And he's got this one diva here who stands out with all of his bling. His Gucci ERA. Dude, I, I, I have to, I just have to believe at some point that these countries are going to stop investing in me so much. I'm still, I'm still above 10% interest and now I have 84% influence with Russia. So they could just take me over at any second at this point. I mean, honestly, Russia, if you, if you decide to take me over, for some reason you kicked out everybody else. So I'm a little nervous about that. If you decide to take me over, I really wouldn't mind at this point. <laughs> Maybe you could annex me, take all my things away I could be done with the episode. You can save me from all my audience who just loves to watch me suffer. Hey, Poland, you uh, got some money? Uh all right, made the global interventionalism. I, for I forgot to record me switching to it, but I, I don't think that really matters. Point is, we have global interventionalism. I don't, I don't think there is... What? Oh, hey, 60%. All right, time to get... You're telling me Lukashenko isn't like a dictator who wants to fuck everybody's ass? That's not the Belarus way. You know what the Belarus way is? That's the Belarus way, baby. That's right, no time to abide by game rules. We're about to get lit here with Lithuania. Ah, there it is. Financial coll- I have been waiting all my years for that one. I mean, I guess you only live once. Might as well go out with a bang. All right, it's time for a real action-packed war. Okay, I don't think it should be that action-packed. They don't even have- <laughs> I can't even cover the front line. This ain't gonna be action-packed for shit. I mean, all it's gonna be is just switch them and say, No! Don't do it! Like, who cares if you join the Swiss Protection League? I mean, look at look at the supply already for them. Oh my god. You got one-man armies. Switzerland, no one's liked you ever. Your, your only friend's dead. Gonna cry? Am I at war with them? Oh, fuck. <laughs> might just dig myself a really grave. They might never join, so I might just be safe till the end of time. Oh, god. That, that was kind of fast. There is an open gap right here, isn't there? Uh, hopefully, you don't beat me. Actually, here we go. Take that. We're showing it to those Swedish nerds. Could take Riga, but I don't know if I even have enough divisions to hold it. That's the problem. I don't have enough divisions to hold this front line. I mean, luckily, they're, they're being idiots just leaving everything wide open for me to take. I, I, you'd think I'd lose this tremendously, but hey, I guess the AI always comes in clutch to save the day. Th this is sad. I was actually expecting something from you Scandinavians. So I think really the main problem right now I have is Belarus is my equipment is just completely ass. And I, I don't have a good feeling that my friends are going to give me a whole lot of equipment. <laughs> just... Wow. Okay. It is time to die. Why is there so much smoke there? Give me... Give me your tanks. You're dead. See ya. I don't know how you how you even let me do that. It's I mean, I mean, what are you talking about? I'm, I'm playing wonderfully. I am outskilling the AI completely. You know what? Before I go down, let me just at least have the privilege to say that I made it to Estonia at some point. Mind if I take a piece of your land just so I can flex on my on my Russian friend here? Thank you. They're making this a little scary now. Go go the hell away, man. I don't think they're going away. I think they just circled us. I think they have kind of gone a little out of containment here a bit. Now you all better get out of there before the Scandinavians eat you up. We, you don't you don't want to you don't want to know what the Scandinavians will turn you into, man. They they're scary people. Well, I guess we can circle the poor Finnish divisions again. I don't think they really care about the Finnish and their faction. Well, since you're gonna leave these tiles wide open, I might as well just take them. Although there you go, you're finally getting pissed again. That's what I wanted. Get mad, and you left your city. Get out of here, bitch. If you'd hurry your ass up anyway. Oh, we don't have fuel. Might want to get some fuel in the in the fucking industry. Why not? We're finally able to kill a tank. It took our, like half our army. But we killed a tank. Please, at least kill one of those divisions. <laughs> I need it. I was just noticed when I requested one of these from the Russians. They're not giving me one delivery of 8,000. They're giving me a monthly deliveries of 8,000 small arms. That is... I don't know how they can afford that, okay? Maybe maybe I'm just used to shitty economies, but how do you afford 8,000 inventory a month to Belarus? That is... that You would need a wicked amount of production for that. Like, you know, I just thought of that... Uh, aren't I really doing Russia's job here at this point? Am I being played for a fool? Is Russia just using me to conquer all of its land for it and sitting back here doing absolutely nothing that's genius if they're letting me beat myself up against these scandies only to invade me after i'm like gone that that's that's a pro game remove by the ai it's using me more than you guys are in the in the, in the in the audience anyway i think i think we're just gonna finish you off you i you've been here for a very long time without guarding 
your 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 country at all. You've just been sitting here wide open. I could invade you ages ago, but I was too worried about the encirclements to really care. Maybe you think it's a good thing because I like you. Maybe you think it's a bad thing because I'm embarrassing you. Either way, you're dead now and you should go cry in a hole. We're going to see if we can siege down Riga first because I kind of want to capitulate Latvia already. They've been alive for way too long. We're just going to flip quickly throw away the Belarusian economy to try to siege down Riga. Sometimes you have to kick the soldiers in the back of their ass and uh, you get wonderful things. I don't like using command powers in Millennium Dawn like that because it, I, I don't have a lot of equipment to spare for stuff like that. But, you know, at this point, what do I have to lose? I, I'm just trying to blob before my economy eventually kills me in the end. I don't know how our economy isn't collapsing. It's, I don't know, man. It ain't looking too good for the military. 41,000 deficit of small arms. I don't even, I didn't even know we had 1.5k self-propelled artillery in the field. I mean, believe me when I said that two-week break from Hoi 480C was awesome. Okay, that was, that might be the best break I ever had. But now that I'm back, I think I'm going to have my worst Christmas break ever. <laughs> The way I talk about this, you're gonna think I fucking hate my life, and secretly I do. But no, don't don't think like that. I am I, I'm completely fine, guys. There's nothing to be worried about over here. Sixty thousand infantry in debt. Ten thousand infantry fighters. I should probably take the planes out of the sky too, because they are, I think shot down half of my air force. You basically destroyed everything I own here. Look at look at this huge repair queue screen. I'm I'm like literally sitting duck. What the fuck you guys waiting for? Kill me so I can be liberated. You know what? I'm gonna make a deal. If you cannot kill me by 2008, I will end the video and say that I beat your asses. How's that? Will that make you want to invade me? Probably not. You're stupid. You're an AI. Not, not fucking. Oh, there we go. I don't mind this because if you do manage to kill me, I'm free. You don't even know. It'd be a Christmas gift cam coming early. Got it. Got it. Got to outdo my uh, division cycling though. I don't think you can, Sweden. Okay, he used to try to brown smoke again, which means he might get an advantage. I know you can beat me if you really try hard enough. You're gonna win this. I feel no. It went yellow. I no. That's not how this is. Sweden, I thought you were gonna save me from the rest of this game and <laughs> you, Here you are you're 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 promoting it. God fuck you I can't help but to imagine these new viewers are coming in just like dude Just 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 leave the game. I cannot leave the game until I it gives me permission to oh shit You're pushing now. I'm gonna pretend to act like I really care and like micromanage so I've been doing this whole time, hasn't it? Why am I announcing that just now? I've really been doing it the whole entire game. <laughs> oh no, encircled. Oh no, there was like probably five men left there anyway. Boo hoo. Ah. Oh no, let me pretend to look like I'm scared. Ah. No. Oh no, they're liberating Latvia. Oh shit. They liberated Lithuania. <laughs> Woo. Oh wait, I don't think they liberated Lithuania. I don't think that's what happened at all. <laughs> I think, I think they just rose up. Oh my God, it's like Nazi Germany. First we got encircled up here, way in, way in Estonia. That's like Stalingrad. And now we have the Warsaw Uprising. The Vilnius Uprising. Dude, this is so realistic. I, I gotta pretend I care so at least I get views and likes. Come on, I need those views and likes. I need the subscribers, come on. Quick. It does take them an awful while to decide to invade Minsk. It's not like they're gonna fight, have much of an opposition there. That's right, you took so long, I got to reinforce it with my helicopters. Yeah, I really made this a lot like a uh, Adolf Schmittler story, didn't I? Holy fuck. I really invaded the same way, and I'm dying the same way. Circled in my capital as the rest of my forces run. Let's go Sweden! 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 Oh! I, I, I went down the same way as Jerp T2. I got split into two pieces. <laughs> Wait, they actually left me alone. <laughs> oh my god. You know what? No. You know what? I I'm sorry. I have to do it myself. <gasps> I'm free! 